Welcome back. A Ball State professor is retiring this way after more than 30 years, and her final project is on stage this weekend. Newslink Indiana's Emily Harless reports. Beth Turcott is a seasoned professor in Ball State's acting and musical theater departments. She taught for 37 years, directed 40 shows, took students on trips abroad, and hosted many projects that have shaped the community and won several awards. Her most notable project is the Cornerstone Center for the Arts, a place where less fortunate kids can go to learn more about theater and the other arts. I'm, but I felt so passionate about make sure kids who couldn't afford it could take classes in the art. My first year after we got it up, open, we had a approximately 15,000 students that went through in some capacity. Turcotte's current project is Gypsy, a musical about a burlesque queen from the 40s named Gypsy Rose Lee and her mother Rose, who has to learn to let her go. Turcotte said this was a special project to end her career on. And I'd been in it twice myself, so it was kind of reuniting with an old friend. Grace Hill, a senior majoring in video production and stage management, is a repeating student of Turcotte's and one of the students who went on their class trip to Paris. She says Turcotte has inspired her and helped her become the person that she is today. Uh, she had a huge influence on my time here, um, starting with the acting class that I took with her my freshman year. I think that that really uh, broke me out of my shell. After all the work Turka has done for the university and community, it is no surprise that Turka is excited for retirement, mainly because she will have more time for her family, especially her mother. She supported me my entire life, and I just want to be able to spend as much time as I can with her. But despite being excited to retire, Turka says she will miss Ball State, especially the students and faculty she has worked with. And I love this university. I mean, I dedicated most of my life to it uh, and promoting it and making sure that it was a place where young people could grow and flourish. In Muncie, Emily Harless, Newslink, Indiana. Anyone wanting to see Beth's final project, Gypsy, can attend one of the last performances this weekend. Showtimes and tickets can be found on Ball State's Theater and Dance event calendar.